Just happy. I'm so excited uh, that both of them have managed to finally get bail. I'm very disappointed in the justice system of this country because we know that uh, those of, his, of the ruling party are being allowed to, or those like the prophets who are affiliated to the party are being allowed to flout the COVID conditions. If you check what happened on that day, they did social distancing, they were wearing masks, there were less than 10 people, and some of them were never even approached or arrested. So our justice system has failed these two ladies. And the right to bail has been completely violated in their case because it has taken three months for them to get bail. And in the seriousness of their case, it's, it's really ridiculous. A lot of other more serious cases for those charged with corruption, they just get bail like that. So I'm very disappointed with the justice system. But at the same time, I'm so happy for Joanna, I'm happy for Cecilia, because finally they are out there. These are not criminals, these are Democrats, these are peace-loving Zimbabweans. The right to protest is protected uh, by Section 59 of the Constitution of this country. So I do not view them as criminals, I view them as concerned citizens of this country. And the way that they've been treated by the justice system of this country, it clearly shows that there is a lot of political influence on how our courts are operating today. It is a shame for democracy in this country.